Hi, welcome to Lunar Lodge Tarot. I'm Juju, and this is going to be a weekly reading from today, Tuesday, till next Tuesday. So it'll be May, June 2021 for a Virgo. You can have Virgo, your sun, moon, rising, or Venus. Okay, please uh, keep in mind everything's subject to free will, your free will, anyone you are energetically connected to is free will, also the will of the divine. No one is free from law of cause and effect. This can be in any area of your life and only take what resonates and leave the rest. So, two shuffles. So, one. And then two. Put the deck. Take it from the bottom. Okay, here we go, Virgo. So, four of swords reverse. Page of cups reverse. And the king of swords. Okay. So, looks like here, you're taking action. You're using logic over love at this point. But there could also be some type of breakup or ending of some type of emotional dependence, possibly. But you're taking action to end something. You might even be taking, or someone could be taking action with this with you about breaking up or to end something. But it's using... It's using logic here. Okay, you could be dealing with a Gemini Libra Aquarius. Very strong Aquarius energy. A Cancer and a Pisces. Or they could have that anywhere in their chart. Let's see. All right, here we go. Okay, taking action to do something legally. So it could be a divorce or it could just be eviction papers. Someone might have been, someone, okay, someone might need to work on being emotionally mature or to depend it on somebody else. Yep, you're taking action to using logic to end something. Also, you could be dealing with a Scorpio as well. Let's see. But I feel like you might be, either you're getting a divorce or you are... Um, doing something with the legal system, you're taking action legally to end something. Possibly, you might be taking legal action against your job, possibly, because someone's been immature or there's been too much uh, emotional independence. But you're trying to use logic here. You're using logic to end something. Let's see if we can get anything else. Okay, take it from the bottom. Yep, so you might be taking action against a pleasure seeker. Pleasure seeker could be anything that's like drunkenness, anything, anybody that has addictions, possibly. It could be sex, drugs, alcohol, any, a lot of drinking, those. Like you're taking action against somebody legally who take, who does a lot of this type of pleasure seeking type of stuff. Yep, you are communicate. you're working on some form of communication to a, to a breakup or to end some type of dependence. Yep, you are also, again, more logic here. Again, this also could be the lawyer. You're ending something in a very legal way. Ooh, hold on. Because it, ne it needs to be. Sorry. Sorry about that. <laughs> you might be seeking counsel about how to end something legally. Let's go again. Okay, yep. You, this might be you, or, you know, this could be you. But there is a wife or a mother figure or someone who's a, a woman who's a mother who is taking action against a pleasure seeker to end, to end the situation. Okay, cheerfulness. There's a letter of communication towards a job that's going to bring happiness, but um, you might be communicating with somebody at your job or communicating with a partner possibly about, no longer wanting to work on something. You might be happy that this might be ending. Yep, I'm telling you, you could very well be doing with a Scorpio. Libra as well. Aquarius very strongly. Could be even Gemini, but very strong Scorpio here. You're researching on how to end a current relationship or situation. Or work. Or someone is trying to do this with you. Okay, let's see. Okay. 
Yep, it's going to take money to do so. Here. Or it could be paying somebody out. Yep, having to do some type of consolation. Not consolation, but it could be like some type of consult about how to, to do this. You dream of some type of celebration or communicating something about work, but there's also a breakup here that's happening. This is like someone who is like the maestro. So the end of romance here. Someone is really, um, you might be ending something to go after someone else, to be with someone else, or they are with you. Let's see. Anything else, please? Anything else, please, Spirit? Okay. Yep. Endings. You have three cards of endings. The coffin, twice, and the death card. So there might be an ending to a financial situation due to pleasure seeking while someone is married or you are this wife or this mother as having to end something with a pleasure seeker taking legal action because it needs to end because they're also keeping secrets from you. There's also, there also could be secret money that's been hidden from you or you are hiding money from someone else. Yep. You're ending something so you can go after someone else. So you can be with someone else or they are with you. Let's see. Last messages, please. Ink pot problems to be resolved. Yep. Financial problems coming to an end, possibly, or financial situation coming to an end. Um, also, someone here might want to be very much be single. We have bird perched. It says waiting for news, package, or letter. Yep. Somebody is getting some type of secret or communication about money or finances here in order to, that maybe they got from work. Um, could be a settlement or some type of payout here so they could end some type of situation. Carriage, a journey, either physical or mental. So someone is really thinking about this and taking action to move forward to end something in a legal situation or in a marriage or to have somebody legally evicted. Rooster, an arrogant, boastful person you should not cross. The pleasure seeker here is someone who's very, very arrogant. Or this could be you. Or it could even be the wife here or this mother figure that can be very arrogant. But somebody here is definitely needing to eat in something. Legal and in love. Somebody's definitely trying to go after somebody else. Climbing towards success. Someone's very arrogant about how they're going to be successful. Um, they're not They're not looking at what the sacrifice is. That, that Somebody here isn't looking at the sacrifice that the other person is having to pay in order for to make the wish happen. We have broken wishbone. Wishes will not be granted. Yep, the way you do about way you go about something or the way they go about something matters. Um, Valley, deep personal strength and peace that assure success, but it's but it's a different type of wish or success. And we also have fire. Strong emotion, passionate, love or hate. So someone is there's gonna be some type of a major argument here with somebody who's gonna be very much a pleasure seeker. And the wife here is trying to climb to the ladder towards success to be able to move forward in her life. To end something legally with a pleasure seeker. Then we also have archway. New opportunities, possibilities, and paths opening up. So somebody here needs to end something with a very arrogant person, a boastful person. Someone who's also very much a pleasure seeker. Um, that might be hiding money so they can achieve their goals and get new possibilities in love and in finances. So they can actually get their bonuses, like their their bonuses. Maybe it's a bonus, but also their um, abundance. Then it says bird flying. News is on the way. Yep, somebody is getting some type of news about someone's arrogant and boastful and uh, pleasure seeking behavior within work and and their about their emotional maturity, but also in love and finances. And that's going to be like the nail in the coffin, so to speak. All right, let me get you an oracle card real fast. Any guidance, please, for my um, we don't have a Capricorn as well. I almost said Capricorn. Anything I can, any guidance, please, for my Virgos and/or Cross Watchers, please. Okay, we have a time to give rather than take New Moon and Virgo. That is you. 
and your hard work is paying off new moon in capricorn you also have you and your loved ones are safe new moon in cancer and anything else please you have the energy is gaining momentum here with transformation movement forward and a time for healing so someone might be ending something to start something somewhere else but in work and in love because but there will be some type of shift in like time frame about ending a relationship starting a new one because there needs to be a great deal of healing well, Virgo and our cross watcher, I hope this has helped you. If you'd like to get a personal reading with me, all the information will be in the description box below. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, um, and hit the notification bell for all notifications. That way you know the next time I upload. Also, you will have your bonus reading from last week, this Saturday. I will have that uploaded, probably set to premiere. Um, okay, so be on the lookout for it Saturday. And also, thank you for all my subscribers for we hit 5,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. So I thank you for all your love and continued support. I really appreciate it. All right. Take care of yourself until next time.